Phu Quoc Island in Vietnam, which falls in the Gulf of Thailand, so it can be accessed from Cambodia and Vietnam both. Getting to Phu Quoc was also quite an adventure, so we were supposed to get here yesterday, but we got here this morning because we were stupid and we did not book the ferry tickets beforehand. We reached the port and it was all sold out. So um, we took a bus from Kantho uh, to Rakia, that's the port. So the ferries run from Ragya and there's this another port, Hatien, and you can also take a straight bus from Ho Chi Minh to Ragya. And uh, after that, we you can get the tickets if it's not busy. Otherwise, just book it online. Get get out of that rush. We did not book it online, and we had to stay in Ragya next to the harbor for a night, and we had to pay so much money for that like 500,000 dong for a stupid room which did not even have anything. Then we took the next ferry, the first ferry in the morning and it took us two and a half hours to get to Fukok and we had arranged a pickup from our hotel, from the resort. It's amazing, like the ferry is really really nice, you won't really realize that it's two and a half hours already. Um, it's cheap, better than the air travels I think. It takes less time, the air travels, but this one is worth it, I think. And we're taking the same way back. And I booked this beautiful resort called Dugong Fukok Resort. And it's a little bit expensive, but it's worth the money I paid because it's just beautiful. Like, I, I don't want to get out of this place. Uh, we have so much to see, but we just thought, Let's just leave it for tomorrow. We have to have to be here just to absorb the beauty It's right next to the beach. So there is this private little beach here and a Little bit of sand and everything and Beautiful restaurant right on the beach and what else everything there's this boardwalk which you can walk on to and This is one of the most beautiful places. I have stayed at um, I'm just loving it here and they have got a nice pool as well. We went into their that pool They have got a good restaurant open for specific times. So make sure of that and I am paying 200 Australian dollars for three nights for a room a little bit expensive But I have saved up on so much like I, I did all of those backpackers hostels and cheap hotels just so that I can spend here it's and it's amazing. I'm just so happy. So we had a whole cottage all to ourselves with a huge room and an open air bathroom. included as well and it was a huge spread. We had pho, fruit salad, bread and a lot of other stuff to choose from um, but being in Vietnam pho was an essential. I stayed there for two days and all I did was eat food next to the beach at this beautiful restaurant and have cocktails and cold coffees by the pool. And most of the time we were in the pool which was beautiful as well and I loved being there I am NOT a water person but the vibe was so nice that I just could not stay out of it we had a live barbecue one night as well where we could choose what we wanted to eat and they would barbecue it for us and serve it on the table and it was so delicious. We had lemongrass chicken and baked potatoes and a few other things. It was super delicious and a first time again. <laughs> 